What's going on, guys? I'm Buddy Absolute Clamber Rocket. I'm going back to the. S what episode is this? I think it's the 7. Sure? 7? Why not? The 7th episode of the Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Randomizer Nuzlocke. Uh, got. Uh. Before I do, like, a recap or whatever, um. I, I, I gotta show you guys something. I gotta show you guys something. Do I even have my right team? I was grinding. Yeah, I have my right team. Okay, so I gotta show you guys something. So. In the last episode, you know, we caught an Escavalier, we took on a gym, but right now we're going to focus on the fact that I caught an Escavalier, right? Okay, so, um, it has the Swarm ability, so if anyone, I guess, Swarm in the last episode, I mean, uh, good job, yeah. But, um, just look at, look at this Escavalier for a minute, right? Just look at it for a minute. Let's see, 10 seconds, let's see if anyone can figure out what's wrong with this Escavalier, right? Nothing. I'm not waiting 10 seconds. So, Escavalier is supposed to have 20 base speed and 130, 130, it sounds like it's said 103, base attack. It has 10 attack, 39 speed. Those at the very least should be switched. So, I've come, I've come to the conclusion that I may have accidentally randomized stats. Bruh. Yeah. So, um... I'm. I don't know if they're completely. If, I don't know if they're like shuffled or what or completely random. I don't know. But this is Cavalier. I 39 speed and 10 attack should not. That should not be a. That shouldn't be a thing on, on an S Cavalier. Maybe other way around. Maybe, but not this. It sh, it should not. Like this thing was ungrindable with just physical moves. It's. It's basically useless, so I don't know what to what to say about it, but like I was looking over like take a uh Dusclops for example. I also noticed it with it. Its defense and special defense should be pretty even still. But its defense is almost double its special defense, so that's not right. <laughs> but I it's just, I don't know how I didn't notice it before, but it's just they're randomized, I get Like, even the stats are randomized, which I did not mean to do. I knew I was going to screw something up in this series. But you know what? It was expected, so... What can I really say? Okay. Anyway, guys, let's go to, I'm going to go ahead and get another encounter to start the episode off. You know, we're going, we're going to do something interesting. I have balls, right? I should have Pokeballs. I really hope I do. Oh, yeah, I also picked up an Alkazite. So, yeah, there's that. So... Which was, it's, just, it's simply just sitting in Slateport, you know, it's just, it's just kind of there. What are we going to get? What are we going to get? An Electrode, okay. It's probably not going to be nearly as fast as it usually is, but, <laughs> you know, I can't paralyze you, can I? You should have more than 40 HP. You, we should be good. I can't paralyze you. You're an Electric type, so. Okay, well, never mind. I guess it didn't have more than 40. What the hell? Okay, guess they're not getting a new encounter yet. God Damn it. Okay, well, screw you, Electrode. Screw you. Like, literally, s screw you. Screw you. All right. Okay, so, anywho, guys. Recently, like, I know I've talked about this. I've finished... I've caught up with the dub of One Piece. So, there's that. And, like, just, like, waiting for more episodes to come out in dub. Because I'm not watching the sub. I just can't. I can't do it. I want, I want to watch... I don't want to read. It's my, that's just my thing with it. But um, there's this like I've like fill my addiction, <laughs> basically. Um, what I've been doing. Okay, I can't go there yet. Um, basically what I've been doing is just watching a bunch of like One Piece like top tens and discussions on YouTube, and it's just like some of those things like they're it gets interesting, you know. Like how else should I put it? So, like, everyone's, like, theorizing, like, what, like, the next members of, like, the, like, the Straw Hats are gonna be and all that stuff. And that stuff gets really, like, people, they get elaborate with this. It's, it's really interesting to watch, because, like, there's a character in the, like, if you don't want spoilers for One Piece, I guess, just tune me out, I guess. But, well, I, this isn't really spoilers, it's speculation, I guess. But, um, there's a character by the name of Captain Smoker, who's, ba like, he... He's basically a marine trying to hunt down Luffy for whatever reason. He's got a vendetta against him, basically. So, people are th like people are theorizing that um he's gonna join the Straw Hats for whatever reason. I'm not sure why, but they are. 
but it's it's really it's interesting like how they go about it like they had so many reasons like why uh smoker would join luffy i just can't remember any of them right now and there's also like this another big one because like something like something that's like where am i going i'm i'm guys i'm so avid today i'm not sure why but you know i just kind of am but um uh what was i what was i talking about okay where's the freaking place i gotta go it's here it's here okay so basically, people were, like people were saying like uh, Smoker's going to join Luffy and blah 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 for whatever reason. But this theory, this theory is next freaking level, and it'd be really cool if it happened. So, in One Piece, there's like this whole backstory regarding the musician of the Straw Hats, Brook, who's a skeleton. You heard me right, He's straight up skeleton, uh, kind of a perv, but you know he he he's a, he's pretty fun. Not gonna lie, but um. Like, Brooke's not, like, Brooke is 90, so, and, like, his, like, he ate the Revive Revive fruit, so, basically, he died, then his soul came back to him, but it was too, like, he was a skeleton by that point, and he got revived, and, like, there's a whole backstory to it, but, like, he and his old crew, which was, like, 50 years ago, um, basically, uh, they left, like, a little, like, a small little whale, back at a place called reverse mountain like on the red line uh, of like one piece it's like it's like like the one large continent encircles the entire world which is like um not sure how that would exactly work but you know what it does and um god my ears itchy ah oh, i don't did not like that but anywho uh basically like there's like this gigantic whale called an island whale named laboon and at at a reverse mountain and at the continent so for like the past however many years like this whale's been waiting for Brooke and his crew to come back so basically like the straw like everyone's theorizing like the straw hats are not going to go all the way back around the world to get back to Laboon they're not going to do that everyone's theorizing that they're just going to straight up destroy a mountain and like the re they get people get so freaking they they pick this apart and frankly i would honestly love it just as like something i'm noticing like it's very hard to like describe the series just go watch one piece excuse me it's a commitment but it's worth it it's very enjoyable just do not watch the four kids dub watch the watch the sub or the actual dub the four all right four kids is notorious for screwing stuff up. You know what? Sidewave sucks. Let's forget Sidewave. Okay, so four kids for a while dubbed One Piece for whatever reason. And a show being about pirates and having Marines and Navy with guns and swords and whatever. S stuff gets stuff gets screwy. Stuff gets very, very screwy. And so like that whole like, for example, like, that whole laboon and the whale thing that happened, um, there was no giant whale. It was an iceberg. They cut out the entire whale. I'm not sure why, but they did. Which is just, like, why? Why of all- why'd you take out laboon? Because, like, that's the whale's name. The whale's name's laboon. I- like, he's just- he's just a- he's like a gigantic puppy dog. It's- like, it's such a sad backstory, but you- I don't know. I'm a sucker for whales, I guess. I'm not, I'm not sure. But four kids. Oh my god. Four kids screws so much stuff up. Like, Sanji, another member of the Strides. He's a cook. He's. He kicks a lot. He kicks. That's his whole. He doesn't fight with his hands, which is really interesting. Because, like, he's a chef. He needs his hands to cook. So he only kicks and stuff. So, for one, his voice in the four kids dub is. horrible. It's just, he sounds like a drunken New Yorker, like, Jesus, it's so bad, it's just, like, of course, like, the actual dub, dub to four kids, like, it makes sense they're gonna be different voice actors, which I, which I get, but Sanji, like, he just sounds so bad, it's, it's just ridiculous, and, like, there's, some, like, the four kids dub, like, like they can't, sh like I'm, they can't show guns. Like some, like the ma Marines, that like, carry guns have like little, like water pistols. Just 
What? It doesn't make sense to me. It's so freaking weird. But, um... That, uh, poor... Just... Like, I was... I never watched four kids when I was a kid. Just because, uh... Like, I just didn't. I'm not sure why. I just never did. Okay, poison powder might be interesting. You know what? Actually... Actually, screw it. We don't need poison powder. Anyway, it's just... Four kids has just been notorious for screwing up one piece. Like... Like, uh... So, like, the character I was just talking about. Sanji, um... He, like, a big, like, trait of his character is that he would smoke. Like, he, like, he smoked cigarettes. And they gave, in the four kids, like, it makes sense they don't want to promote smoking. It makes total sense. But they gave him a sucker. Like, he always has a sucker in his mouth. And it's just, I don't know what it is. I mean, it was an innovative idea. But, it's... You, you, you know, you go from cigarette to a sucker, and it, just, it looks so odd. It's it's so weird. It's it's just so weird. But, um... Uh, that, actually, that actually reminds me, because, like, um... I've told a bunch of stories about how, like, I'm, I'm in Scholars Bowl in high school and stuff, blah, blah, blah. And, um... That reminds me, like, this, like, my sophomore year, so this is, like, two years ago... We went to uh, Scholars with me, which is just, it was just focused directly on pop culture. So, it was like, music, uh, recent movies and TV shows. Um, there were multiple anime questions, which I thought was really cool. And, um, one of them was about One Piece. It was like, who is the main protagonist of the long-running Shonen Jump uh, manga, anime, whatever, One Piece? And it was Luffy. But here's the thing. Um, I'm pretty sure... That the moderators had no idea what they were... Like, if I... I'm trying to remember this correctly. I can't remember if no one said it, or if someone said it correctly, but the moderator... Like, the moderator is, like, the person, like, reading the questions and, like, say, like, that's incorrect and that's correct and blah, blah, blah. I don't remember if someone got it right, but the moderator thought they didn't say it correctly. They said Monkey... They said Monkey D... Lu like, it's Monkey D. Luffy. But they thought it was pronounced Luffy. Monkey D. Luffy. So I don't think they gave it to him. And from I Okay, so Okay, actually, now I'm thinking about this. It was either the moderator that said, um that's incorrect like Monkey D Luffy or the person who answered it was on the other team. I was not going at this point. Like I was sitting out for this, I'm pretty sure. Said Monkey D Luffy. Which is just no, it's Luffy. It's Luffy. Anyone who's watched it, it's Luffy. I had yet to watch One Piece at this point. Like, me watching One Piece is a recent development, but it's... Guys, it's a commitment. I'm pretty sure I started back in October. It took me three months to get... Like, three months to watch 600-some episodes. But, God... It was just... It was very... It was interesting. Like, uh... A lot of times in Scholars Bowl, it's... It can be hit or miss with a lot of stuff. But that was a miss. And... I'm pretty sure that same me, like, they have a rule, if your phone goes off, you gotta leave the room, no questions asked, don't moan about it, you just gotta, you gotta leave. It doesn't matter if you're a player, if you're in the audience, because we people can watch, but I'm pretty sure during that same meet, I thought I'd turn my ringer off, I, my ringer off, oh, I gotta do the contest stuff, are you kidding me? Sure, f why not? Okay, whatever. But uh, I forgot to turn my ringer off, I got a Twitter notification, I was like, oh, son of a, I was like, okay, I'll leave. Because, like, they're going to make me do it anyway. Might as well leave my dignity, which I... I did. <sighs> that, that was so embarrassing. Anyway. Think, like, speaking of other embarrassing things at uh, Scholarship Meets I've been in. Um, there's this girl in Scholarship Meets. I'm not going to say her name, just because I don't think she would want me to tell this story. But if people who know me, they, they know what I'm talking about. So, there's this question now that, that was asked. It was like... What is the name of, like, a naturally occurring well? And no one really knew what... So, uh, the other team took a guess. They said Geyser. Which, I was going to buzz in. I was going to guess Geyser. But they got first. Like, they got first. They said Geyser. It was wrong. So, th this girl was sitting next to me. Whispers in my ear. It's like, I didn't... I I thought... I just said, just buzz. I have no guess. Just buzz. And, like, I just like, just go ahead. Just go ahead. I... I thought I heard her wrong, but no, I heard her exactly right. She buzzes in, says glory hole. If you know what that means, you know what it means. If you don't want, if you don't know what it means, now 
I'll put up what she meant right now. I'll put that up right now. But um, everyone else's mind in the room went somewhere else. Except for the moderator, because the moderator is a very, very religious, was a very religious person. So, she was asking her to, like, repeat what you, like, repeat what you said, and it was, it was just one of those things. Wait, 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 is the, is the, is the Pikachu going to be randomized that we get? That might be a thing. I'm not sure. But anyway, like, she said that, and it was just, it was just, I'm sorry, you, what? <laughs> and I... Like, she was asked to repeat it. I was like, do not repeat it. Do not repeat it. Because the moderator was one of our coaches. Because, like, we just needed an extra moderator. Because someone didn't show up, I'm pretty sure. I said, do not repeat it. Do not repeat it. It, w it was wrong anyway. But, that, that, that was something. That was, that was something. That was something. Like, we all had a really good laugh about it. And, like, no one knew that it was, like, an actual thing that she was talking about. So, we all just, like, we all just assumed, like, her mind went somewhere else and, like, thought of something different and said that. It was, it was just, it was weird. It was, like, after, like, the meet ended, she was like, like, I told you, it, I told you it was an actual thing. I'm not stupid. I'm pretty sure that's exactly what she said. But, wow. It was, just, <laughs> it was something else. It was something else. Okay, can I get, can I just, skip, you know what, I'm speeding up for this, I'm gonna speed up for this, hold on, one, one second. Okay, let's, uh, do, 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 Okay, yeah, we're gonna speed this up a bit, yeah, here we go. It's like, we don't need to bother with this, okay? Yeah, 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 we get it. Okay, so, speaking of other embarrassing Scholars Bowl stories, <laughs> um, uh, my, my sister, who's three years older, older than me, used to be in Scholars Bowl when she was in middle school. This is when I was in fourth grade, and I was a runner for Scholars Bowl. Basically, I was the guy that would take the score sheets, like the people like running like the like, like they would, like basically they would. Uh, how do I word this? Uh, basically, they would. Uh, how do I word this? Son of a. Basically, what they would do is they would. I don't know how to word this. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. Uh, basically, what they would do is they would put like all the team's scores, like how they're doing on the board. So that's what they would. That's just what they would do. So basically, the runners would just basically take the pieces of paper of like the score sheets to uh, the people doing that. So I was the runner, and this was like a room my sister was in. And basically, what like what would happen? Like, this question came up. It, the question was, I remember this very vividly. My parents were in the room as well. And, um, they said, name an NFL football team based in Florida with the mascot of a cat. Now, if, now if, uh, if you know... If you know football, you know who they're talking about. They're talking about the Jacksonville Jaguars, right? My sister, the cat part just went in, like, in one ear, out the other. She buzzes in and screams, Miami Dolphins! Yeah. It was fun. Wait, did I win that? <laughs> Oops. <laughs> did, did not know. Okay. Anyway. She just screams out, Miami Dolphin. I was like, oh my, like, I was, I didn't know either. I just knew it wasn't Miami Dolphins. So, I knew that much. Okay, oh wait, this guy gives us the Pokemon. He gives it, oh, it's a Simapore? Okay, screw that. Okay, maybe he has a, an ability, I guess. Oh man, a Simapore, are you serious? But yeah, my sister, like, she said Miami Dolphins. And then the fact that, why do you have Meteor Mash? Yo, Meteor Mash and Scald and Storm Drain? Excuse me? Okay, okay, okay. Never mind. Okay, I'm going to turn it back to normal real quick. One second. But yeah, she, she screams out Miami Dolphins. Everyone laughs about it. Like, she doesn't get it for a couple seconds. And then she realizes, oh wait, he said cat. 
So we all had a fun laugh about that. I still will not let her live this down. And she knows I will never let her live it down. Because it's, it's, it's so, it was just funny. I mean, I'm her little brother. I give, I give her so much hell. And frankly, it, sometimes it's deserved, sometimes it's not. More often not. But there have been so many times where my sister is just, she is just basically screamed at me or just wailed on me for no reason. She just assumed I did something. Like, a, a while back, she was in a bad mood, she was in her room, but there's a bathroom right, like, right by her room. So I, it's like, I just told, hey, don't go bother her, she's in a bad mood, blah, blah, blah. So I was going to the bathroom, and I have my handle on the bathroom door, and I'm halfway in the bathroom, and she just screams, don't come in here, don't do it! Like, she got mad, <laughs> and I hadn't yet to do anything. I say yet, I wasn't planning on doing anything, but I probably would have eventually, I mean, it's, little, really, Oh, Dark Cry, a slow start. Oh, that's so sad. Okay, headbutt. That's super effective, because pixelate. Yeah, there we go. That's what we like to see. But, uh, she just... She got real mad real fast. So, um... Like, I just di I didn't do anything. And she just... Like, she didn't apologize later, because, like, I was just going to the bathroom, man. I didn't deserve that. <laughs> but, you know, it's it, it was one of those things. It was one of those things. Okay, so, right, cricket tune. We can hear the best cry in the game. I'm gonna be quiet for this. Uh, Dragon Ascent. Let's go. Gotta be quiet for this. Best, best cry in the game. Here we go. Best cry in the game. Gotta love it. You gotta love it. All right, sorry, cricket but you do in fact have to die. Bye. I really hope I one shot this. But. <laughs> But you know what? I I always say this. My sister most certainly has anger issues. She like she's if she sees us, she's gonna get real mad. But you know what? She's in Minnesota. I don't care. Like, um, uh, I feel like I uh my entire like my entire family like anger is just it's 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 something. My sister gets mad really easily. When my my dad doesn't get mad as easily, but they're. Like, my sister probably gets my, like, her anger from our father. And then, like, like my dad, when my dad gets mad, like, as a kid, I thought I was scared, because, you know, wait, it's your dad, he's screaming at you, blah, blah, blah. But, um, now that I'm older, it's, it's just kind of funny. It's just, like, it, it's just kind of funny. But then, you know, my mom, my, my mother, my mom, wow. When she gets mad, when she gets mad, oh, it's, she ha she has a voice. She has a certain voice. And, like, I don't know how to describe it. It's, like... Like, it, like, she... It gets a very high pitch. It's very... I'm not sure what the... I'm not sure what the word would be, but I just don't. You learn... You learn crunch so early, Tortuga. Okay, I'm chill with that. Anyway, she... She gets mad, right? She gets, like, she gets mad. She gets a voice mad. Like, she's much scarier than our father. <laughs> but, um... Then there's my sister, who just, she just gets mad super easily. Like, she... Like, she doesn't have a voice. She just gets... She just gets really pissed. Th then there's me. I, I feel like I get angry the least amount. Like... I just feel like that... I feel like I do... If I do get mad, like, I'm... Like, I will... Sh I show more frustration... I... In my opinion, I think I look more frustrated than angry most of the time, but, you know, maybe there's some other people that I know that... I'm trying to forget Slam. I gotta pay attention. I don't want to know Slam. No. Keep all moves. Thank you. But, uh, yeah. I feel like I, in my family, I get mad the least, or the least severe. Because, <laughs> like, I never really, like, bite anyone's head off. I'm like... Like... Unless, like, like, ba like, unless I get some, like, uh, actually, not, I'm trying to think of some, like, I can't think of anything, right? Like, I've gotten so mad, I've just basically, like, just screamed at someone. Maybe, maybe a couple times, like, I just, like, someone's, like, in the wrong place at the wrong time, and, actually, no, not really. I'm trying, so, I'm trying to, <sighs> frick, like, say, like, I stubbed my toe or something. Like, I will get, like, it hurts, and just, like, son of a, and just, yeah, all that, like, all that jazz. And, uh, 
if someone's just like right there like hey it's like yeah yeah i'm fine like okay they didn't do it i don't really bite their head off they didn't they're just there and they're just saying i'm okay it's just, yeah it just hurts like a ugh so fenton can you stop hitting yourself please is that an option please okay guys i'm actually gonna fight uh should i fight my i got all right i swear to god fenton if you hit yourself thank you but like I feel like I don't get very mad that easily. I just I just don't think I do. Like the other things just like, oh are you serious this sucks. This like I, I get frustrated very I feel like I get frustrated very easily. But I don't think I get mad. <laughs> Maybe some. Eh, depends. Like I'm not like I don't like burst out and say it. Like I'm not I'm not explosive about it. I just like, alright. Just calm down, calm down. Like, you're... <sighs> like, I try to breathe through it sometimes. Okay, anyway. Can this little... Can this kid just leave me alone, please? Alright, close combat. Here we go. I still can't believe I randomized the stats. That... Uh, that'd be something I would do. But yeah, that's... That's something else. That is just something else. Alright, little pup, close combat. Bada a freaking Bing! But yeah, okay. Should I fight? I'm not gonna. I'll, I'll fight May in the next episode. I'll fight May in the next episode. So we got a Simapore, I guess. That's something. I made a little bit of pro. I made a little bit of progress. I basically just talked about stuff a lot this episode. So I'm not gonna lie. Like when I have like, so guys, I'm not gonna lie. I wrote down like a list of, like things and segues to talk about this episode. And like from like the One Piece thing, to, like my sister's Miami Dolphin story. All of that I was like, okay, I want to talk about this, 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 and this. And just everything else is just... That was just... Okay, May's up here. I'm going to save and I'm going to end the episode before I, I run into a battle or something. Like, that was that was interesting. I, this was, this, I enjoyed this. I enjoyed just, like, talking just about random crap. It's very fun. It's very fun. I'm getting better at commentary. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys all enjoyed this episode. Please like, subscribe, and comment down below. And, you know, just wait for the next episode. I mean, I finally have, like, a set schedule for the series. It's Tuesday, Friday, Saturday. Because I, I feel like that works. You have like two, you have like a two days between like every like chunk of episodes. I feel like it works. I feel like it works well. Anyways, like I said, please like, subscribe, comment down below, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace.